Hey, what is up, guys? It is Steve Irvine here. Today, we are going to be taking a look at a big, beautiful base that was built by X Deco Croft XX. Now, we're going to be going through his town, also known as Big Gay Land, and we're going to be taking a view of this of this absolutely gorgeous castle that he's built over here. So, let's get to it, guys. Now, before we begin, do you know why it's called Big Gay Land? It's called Big Gay Land. Because all the biggest gays in all the land come and they flock here. They flock here for safety against bigots and they flock here to mate. They flock here to find love. And honestly, this is just their nesting ground when it, when the weather becomes too uh, too cold for them to go shirtless. They fly south to Big Gay Land and this is where they congregate for the uh, winter, just like migratory birds. Now, let's go check it out, guys. Now, we are entering Big Gay Land here, and this is the first time that any heterosexual human being has been in Gay Land. As you can see, these houses have been built perfectly. Here come some of the big gays now. They're obviously very displeased with our presence. We're just going to go right around. Oh, look, there's one of the adopted children. We're just going to go <laughs> right. <laughs> it's going to try to get right around them. Go over the big gay bridge. Come on, cameraman. Don't be scared. <laughs> the fucking big gays. When they're attack, they're bad. <laughs> Get to the castle. <laughs> okay, guys. It was very intense. But we managed to get away and take refuge over here by the customs house. Now, this house... We were talking to the customs officer and he did have to check our ass holes to make sure they were at least nine inches in diameter before he would let us into the castle. But luckily we had just been through a lot and uh, my friend over here just got out of prison. So his ass hole was just the right diameter. So they gave us permission to move up into the castle. So let's, uh, let's go take a look. It was quite a harrowing tale, but uh, I don't think that the big guys were too happy with us calling them net. Oh yeah, my cameraman has just expertly pointed out that there is a trap right here. They obviously don't want any heterosexual men to uh, make it into their settlements. As you can see, the nefarious guys have put a lava trap right here. Anybody who's anybody who's too heterosexual for their own good is, is dead anytime. Luckily, we're both a bit bi-curious, so uh, we made it through without a scratch. Now, as we come into this big beautiful base here, we can see the architecture is truly magnificent. Got those beautiful flags waving off in the distance. Behind me, you can see the uh, behind me. You can see the flags over there, blowing off in the distance. You can see these beautiful banners over here. It just looks absolutely gorgeous in the moonlight. We're going to take a look inside this uh, tower eventually, but first, we're going to go take a look right inside the main throne room. Yep, unfortunately the king is out. Um, he said he needed to go suck his own cock for a little while, so you know, he's not he's not with us right now. But we do have access to his throne. And uh, as you can see, he's claimed the heads of two of his victims over here. We have um, unspecified duck men. Obviously he's quite the hunter. And over here we have faggot horse. Now, as you can see, the rainbow design obviously denotes uh, gay pride in Faggot Horse. So this is obviously one of his more intimate prizes. And as you can see, there's some there's some white stuff right around the mouth area over there. So it's seen some extensive use, as you can see. Now, over here by the throne, we have a piece of coal. Uh, obviously, rotated a bit. You can see that this is obviously to symbolize, you know, the plight of the, um, of the Mexicans as they escaped back across the border. I'm going to take a look up here in the castle now. Up here we can see the beautiful lava flows. Right over here you can see the uh, the balcony overlooks. Just has a gorgeous view. Oh no! The guys, they've, they've spotted us! Cameraman, no! Don't fight! Just run! 